Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to a Dying Light. Today we're gonna do things, and things will be good. So, what are we doing? <laughs> I keep teleporting every time. Did I log off down here? I'm pretty sure I logged off down here. But we spawned up here somewhere. Wait, I don't know where I am. I'm lost. Where am I? Am I over here? I think I'm over here. Apparently I have a mission here. Alright, let's go turn it in, I suppose. Wait, is this just here? Oh no, this is Bilal. Ah, right. He's my drop dude now, of course he is. Uh, I'm gonna stop getting fireworks just because I've... Screw it. <laughs> I can't resist. We will use them eventually. Oh, sweet. Level 2 traction power, that's cool. I'm gonna take the landmines now as well. Take it from girls. I can carry so many bolts. It's unusual. Cool, and I need a shop. Because if you remember, in the last video, he still wants to talk to me. No. Oh, this wants to talk to me. Believers! Under no circumstances are you allowed to enter the nearby town. Our worst fears are confirmed. The former military quarantine there has become the most dangerous place in the countryside. You are not to risk your lives by facing this danger yourselves. Hey, Bilal, this note about the town. What's this danger the faceless are warning people about? <sighs> no idea, man. We don't go into the town anymore. People who went into scavenge say there's demons in there. I know we've got zombies to deal with, but demons? What the hell? Seriously, no clue. I haven't been there in a while. Don't know what it's about or what they're trying to resolve. But it would help you guys out if the town got safer, right? Uh, well, yeah. We didn't have a chance to get anything out of there after the outbreak. But just so you know, the military ran everybody out of there before any infected even showed up. And you think it might have been related to this demons thing? Could be, man. Could be. We won't know until the faceless get it all under control, though. You think maybe I'll be the one getting it all under control. We don't go there anymore. She goes to a different school. Uh, I need a shop. Because I have no ammunition whatsoever. Hello, shop man. I would like to sell my unviable valuables. Oh my, oh my, hello, the damage on that beauty. Okay, cool. Is that what I'm using right now? Yeah. Uh... I am sometimes tempted by a... Wait, no, this has the same rate of fire. Never mind. It's been gone. Ooh, I don't need that anymore, then. I'm going to use the axe instead. Yeah. Right, see you later. SMG we need. Molotov we don't need anymore. Flares feel kind of useless, but that's okay. Conduct? No, I don't care about that. I've got the Dragon G as well. I don't really need this, either. 894 damage? That's rubbish. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, what can we buy? We can buy... Wait, wait, wait. Did I just sell... No, I'm not that stupid, right? No, no, no. I'm... It's fine. <laughs> I thought I'd sold all my important stuff for a second. <clears throat> awesome. Oh, that damage. I really need to get some of the levels in this, but we're, we're a while away from that, I think. Loop again, power cable, rubber... Do, 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 do. Alright, we're, we're spending a decent chunk of cash here, because I have to buy all the money we can. How many bolts can I carry? <laughs> I must have so many. Right, so where are we off to? Um, what's this over here? It's a hive. Is there a bed here? Can I... Yeah, let's go Let's go destroy a hive. How's that for a tippity-toppity plan? Bippity-boppity-tippity-toppity. Uh, bed, 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 bed. I always know it's a good plan when it involves waiting till the terrifying night time. Mm. Sorry, I need a beverage. Uh, right. Yeah, let's go kill the hive. Oh, discharger. Cool. So many little things that I've inevitably made. I, like, I feel like, generally speaking, I'm pretty good at picking stuff up. It's a... <laughs> A life skill, I know, but genuinely one I've honed since the days of playing, um... Oh no. That sucks. Alright, well, I've got to go do this first. Um... Okay. 
Is this the way to lose a pursuit? I'm not convinced, but I'm trying. Pretty sure it's not, though. Ow. I need, like, a drop or something? I need something topsy-turvy if I'm going to lose these guys. A bridge. That'll do. Oh, that's a bollard. That's a fun little jump, though. <laughs> those, are, those challenges are rough. Whoa. They're everywhere at night time, man. Night time is more terrifying in the car than it was on foot. I feel like it's harder to get away, in a way, you know? Or well, it's harder to avoid them along the way. You know what I mean? Because they've got this big radius around them. Whereas in the past, it just used to be like a little cone. I guess the idea is that they can, I don't know, hear the vehicle? Alright, where am I going? How far away are we? It's there. I probably want to go down this way, and then across the bridge. Alternatively, <laughs> straightforward. Oh, how far away is that drop? Ah, so far away. Okay. On the plus side, if we keep doing all these... Um, it's like the game said earlier. If we keep doing all these nests, these hives... God damn it. I'm just going to hop out, I think. Then, um... There will be less and less of these volatiles hanging around outside at all. If we just keep doing it, eventually, maybe the map will be... Like, almost entirely empty, you know? That'd be really cool. I regret dropping my car off quite so far away. But we've made it. I've still got my shield. forgot about that. Ooh, easy does it, girl. Easy does it. Okay. Well, at least I know what I'm uh, trying to do here this time. It doesn't necessarily feel good, but at least I know why I'm here. I'm trying to use melee for a little bit, just keep things a little bit quieter. Which I'm sure it's the logical thing to do. And obviously it upsets me to my core. <laughs> to do said logical thing, but whatever. <laughs> On we pop. We've got 3 minutes 44 seconds. It's actually not that much time. We should uh, get a shift on. I'm hoping this one's an easy one just because it's nearer the starting base bit. Nice. In we go. God, he didn't even die. He started to wake up. It was terrifying. Pain in my ass, son. You know that. So many enemies! Come here! <laughs> Thank you! Oh, oh, that's a bad thing! Let's swap that out. Thank you very much. Uh, we need to craft with this. God hammer. Okay, let's do it. And then we need to upgrade the God hammer. Oh, it's just called Deadly Fireman Zark. It's weird. <gasps> Look at that damage! <laughs> I thought, they, I thought upgrades didn't affect damage. That clearly just jumped up by like 400. 
I don't understand this game at all. Nobody understands this game. Everyone keeps telling me things, and then it's always wrong. <laughs> all right, this thing's going to be a monster. It's... Look at that damage! Although I might die in the process. Fuck! Oh, it's super slow, isn't it? Is that a two-handed weapon? Oh, well. Guess we're trying something new. Never used a two-handed weapon. Oh, camouflage. That's really... Yo, I just got a, a legendary from that. That's awesome. Maybe I should try to loot the spooky guys more. Right, I need to get over there somehow. Yeah, okay, 200... Wait, wait, wait. This is important then. So, wait, let me level my agility up. Oh, which is miles away. Um... Hmm. Hmm. And... Power. So, I got this. Hold B while in midair to execute. Okay, so we this is a good time to then start getting these. Uh... So I've got like a whew, whew, big windmill power attack, which is cool. And it's time to use it. You ready? Absolutely fuming the lot of them. It seems awesome. I never really considered using a um a two-handed weapon because I never found a good one, you know? He he just died. I never had like a good two-handed weapon to upgrade. It was always a rebar, which always had like rubbish stats, right? Not the case anymore, ladies and gentlemen. Not the case at all. I have to be a little bit more careful because they do get hits in more often. But man, it does some damage. There it is. I knew there's one here somewhere. I can find it. I did it. Oh, oh! Don't die now! Don't die now! Heal! Heal! Get out of it! Right. Cool, now we just have to get out of it. I, like, I'm sure you could kind of ignore the zombies nearly entirely and just kind of, um, you know, sprint around looking for the guys you need to take down. Actually, honestly, if you just camouflage yourself, it really wouldn't be a challenge at all. Imo, just kind of camouflage, run in, kill the thing, run on. Can't see it being a problem. But alas, I am totally not sure how to get out of here. <laughs> um, like, I feel like. Oh, is it here? I couldn't see this at all from the other side. It's just a way out. It doesn't feel like a way out. No, it must be right. It must be. I must have climbed more than I realized. Sweet freedom! Sweet glorious freedom. Sweet glorious freedom. No? <laughs> uh, how do I get out? <laughs> I feel like I cheat my way out of a lot of situations with this thing. Oh, excuse me. Oh, God, that was probably very loud. I'm very sorry. It still has a marker on, so I feel like maybe there was a way out on the other side. If I'd gone that other way, I would have found the thing to get rid of the marker, basically. I love this thing. I mean, I love it in that it, it wrecks shit, basically. <laughs> I'm still not big on elemental weapons and stuff like that. It's not really my jam, but... Sometimes you got to get new jam, you know? you got to be willing to change your jam. Oh, beautiful. You need repairing or anything? You okay? Feeling good? Well, two traction. Oh, sweet! I can upgrade this straight from here. That's a that's a nice little touch. Uh, yeah, screw it. We've got loads of screws, loads of tubing. There we go. Everything's level two. Look at that beast. What a monster she's become. Good old BT. 
Ram da 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 da. <laughs> it's a big boy. <laughs> it's hard to realize. Right, what do you want me to do? Is this kill like a number of zombies? Yo, it's a lot of zombies. Right, let's go. Surely stuff like this is much easier later on when you've got all the upgrades. Like the one that literally makes you much better at killing zombies, for example. <laughs> That one was pretty easy, I'll admit. Over here, we've, we've done a lot of quests. I'm expecting some uh, good stuff to go down here. Oh, hello. Oh my god, you're terrifying. <laughs> oh, so you're one of the faceless. Will you let me speak to the mother? You think she would speak with a stranger? No, but you are on the right path if you wish to join our ranks. Be patient. What's your name? Kyle Crane. Bob. You have a long road ahead of you, Kyle Crane. Do not stray from it. And may this help you in your struggle. Yeah. That's all we have to say to you for now. Hype. I was looking forward to the bow. You can the crossbow. I feel like... Can I upgrade it? Oh, I can. I can make a heat wave. It's a fire one. Right. Does this change damage? 360 damage. Is that going to do anything? Let's find out. 480. This game's weird. <laughs> I think it's just a case of some upgrades change damage and some don't, basically. But really, the key point is, and this is very stupid game design, and I will say this to the ends of the earth, why on earth does it not show me the stats of the guns I'm changing? Or when, like, when I craft something with a gun? It's such a bizarre behaviour, honestly. Uh, what do I like least out of all these? Probably the pistol. I'm not, I'm not getting rid of it, obviously. I don't need it right now. Didn't you break? Oh, you are broken. I'm gonna sell you. That's why. Oh, it's night time. Fireworks. Let's keep that in mind. This is very, this is very messy. <laughs> I can't, can't be having this. Leave now, newcomer. You, you what's wrong? What's, what's going to leave, on? Though? We don't have a clue. Everything seemed all right, and suddenly people started feeling sick. I hope you know something about it. Um, I don't, but. I'll see if I can figure out what's going on. They give over trust very easily, don't they? Strange well, request. Jazeera, who drew this? Oh, that's not important. The kid keeps drawing them. I keep throwing them away. Well, but what's it about? Something the kid's hung up on. His mother took a job in Haran before the outbreak. Left him with his grandparents. She was supposed to send him a gift, I guess. But you know what happened. Doesn't matter. Just toss it. Oh, Mr. Pokes. Oh. Oh no! It's so sad. This kind of stuff breaks my heart. I'm I'm really bad with this kind of stuff. Like that genuinely upsets me. So this whole time the kid's been waiting on a present. Christ. Top. Priority. But the sooner he gets used to being sad, the better. Screw you, Jasia. I'm gonna save him. Oh my god, there's so many. Believers! Recently we asked Arshan and Turhi to make that farm safe haven for new families in need. However, they face a problem we can possibly oversee foresee. Brothers and sisters, we are tested again, this time by a new breed of undead. Unbelievably strong freaks of nature that we still don't know how to kill. We ask for prayers in Arshan and Turhi's memory, as well as compassion for Erla and Mele, who managed to escape the slaughter, yet still had to witness the tragedy that befell their dearest friends. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> People, start saving the yellow roots Sabit was bringing us, because there's no telling what's been going on with him lately. If anyone hears anything about him or sees him anywhere, give me a sign as soon as possible. Yes, so you know, Jazir. Who's this Sabit? He was supposed to get you guys some medicine? Yes, yes he was. He was bringing us fresh herbs every single week. 
Oops. But we haven't heard from him for too long now. Oops. I know he's probably dead, but we can't be sure. You don't know the man. He wanted to become one of the faceless. He wouldn't let himself get killed easily. Well, any idea where I should look for him then? And what about those fevers? You still need some herbs, right? Herbs. He lived in a hut out on that rocky island. And yes, he always kept medicine there. Just be careful. If something's got to sap it, it's no laughing matter. Why do you ignore the H? I've never understood. Believers, we ask you to pray in memory of Erkan and his family tonight, and in I used to have a friend called Erkan, and in hopes that his mother's power will aid his daughter in overcoming the trauma. Do not lose hope, brothers and sisters, even if the trustees are need to sneeze. <laughs> Committed by those monsters seem too hard to bear. Tell me immediately if you see any strangers nearby. Don't let the bandits surprise us as he's surprised. It is here. Those bandits who took over Erkan's farm. Erkan. Aren't you afraid they're going to target you guys next? On air. We can handle them, but we're no soldiers. I won't send people to die out there. Well, your set of skills might come in handy in this situation. Just talk to Eski. She'll explain the kind of scum you'll be dealing with. There's a glorious beard. Maybe try to find Polat too. He used to work at Erkan's farm. Maybe he'll have something useful to tell you. So many little missions. We'll pay for Bolter lives. Okay. <laughs> Zero, I gotta ask. Why the hell do you want bolter livers? Oh, livers. That made more sense. Those bolters. They keep desecrating the graves of our beloved. They eat the corpses we've laid out for the wind to take. Okay, but the livers... For heaven's sake, don't they teach you anything in the city? It's about the smell. You can use it to attract more of the same kind. It's the thremo, thesmo. The pheromones. Yes, that's what I said. Or could you use it to scare them off? And that's what I wanted to say. You learn fast, boy. Okay, so these bolters are attracted to fresh bodies you, what, leave for the wind? Yes. If you see a bolter, just run it over with your car, okay? That'd be much appreciated. And remember about the livers. The swift-footed bolters feel safer in the fields of the countryside, so they venture outside during the day and sleep after nightfalls. The easiest way to find them is visit their feeding grounds marked on the map. Huh. Alright. Now, Zan's been missing for two days now. She probably went back to Old House again. She was paranoid her grandma's ship might have been looted by bandits. Can someone track her down? Cool. At least she's not talking to me anymore, although I still have to talk to someone over here. Is it you? I think it's you. You don't seem that interested, though, do you? You're just kind of a creepy son of a bitch. <clears throat> a phlebotomizer. No more music until you talk to me, okay? <laughs> That's the deal. He doesn't want there's so many quest markers. Alright, over here. Hello, stranger. Hello, child. Yeah, that's what they get first. Hey kid, I gotta drop by the post office so I could uh, check and see if your package is there. You know what's inside? A present? From mommy? She wrote and said she was sending me a surprise present. She's coming back after I get it too. And she can play with me again. Stop it! No! She's dead! <laughs> She's so dead! Ooh, proper longsword. Ooh, deadly shots. Oh, I like these. <sighs> it's sad. I don't like it when people are upset. Again, like, I know this is obvious and nobody likes people being upset, but, just, but even in video games, it just really bugs me, you know? I'm sad now. I'm gonna get your present, kid. Your mum's still going to be dead, but you'll have a present, at the very least. And if not, I'll bring you a bloody bolt of liver or something. I don't know what you kids like these days. Hey, Paula. I'm thinking about heading to Erkan's farm. You're crazy, mister. That's suicide. Hey, let me be the judge of that. Besides, the bandits might target this place next. Let them fucking try. After what they did to that girl, there won't be no mercy. Well, if you feel that way, then why wait? Why not take revenge right now? Don't get all high and mighty with me, mister. We are angry, true, but we are not crazy. You want to get yourself killed? I think I can handle some thugs with guns. I heard you might be able to help me. Jazir said you worked at that farm? Work there I did, true. If you really do want to go there, follow the wall and go east of the entrance. There's a hole in that high wall. You could probably use it to sneak in. Alternatively, <laughs> I have this magical thing. 
Oh, we actually do have to go in now. Okie dokie. The quest. Oh, it's Esky. Hey, Esky, I've... Oh. That's, uh... That's Erkan's daughter, right? No. That's not her. That's what's left of her. She was the happiest person I'd ever known, but now... I'm sorry, but... She's, uh... Conscious, right? Conscious, yes. But the longer she lies there, the more I feel like she just doesn't want to live anymore. When she was still speaking, she told me they hurt her. And her mother. They shot her brother in the face, Kyle. Made her watch. All right, I'll take care of it. They won't hurt anyone else. Yeah, of course. Sorry. I just think I've heard it too many times before. Amen, sister. A bloody man. I talked to the survivor in the... Why is that survivor highlighted? He's the crazy dude in the attic, right? We already talked with him. I don't know why he's important, but... Apparently he is. Right, let's go see if Thingy will uh, talk to me now. He has a big old exclamation point above his head. What is he, right? Or is it something else in the area? Sometimes it could be like a sheet or something. It does appear to be you, though. The barrel? Oh, whatever. Maybe the game wants me to do something else first. Okay! <clears throat> Lots of new quests. Look for Sabit. Huh. Uh, return to the pumping station, clear the area. Okay, we can go do that first. It's, it's first on the map, and that is enough to make me want to do it first, really. That's really all it takes. Let's go! Sick tricks! <laughs> all about the glory of the mother, my friend. Look, I just want to help. And we are allies now. It's not enough. Hey, I don't understand. Just wait. Hunt down the bolter! So fast, what the hell? Get it! Ah! Rusing me! Perhaps we owe you an apology. <laughs> you help us, and yet we still do not entirely trust your intentions. We understand it might Come be here. to expect someone to praise the mother without seeing the sign. I've got nothing to hide. <laughs> Intentions are pure. Come here! <laughs> Make your way to the lake known as the Eye of the Sun. Bow down and look. Hey! You shall receive her blessing. We invite you to meet with us, Kyle. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die for this goddamn bolt to liver. <laughs> I'm assuming I got that because I got to a pretty high level in my, um. Oh my god. I am I uh Am <laughs> I uh ally thing? Bloody Nora <laughs> Eh Oh it is only an easy though. Yeah, go on then. Anything high and medium I probably wouldn't bother. Those boulders are hard to chase down, man. I'm sure that'll get easy as we, uh... There's just really no point in doing that. It'll get easy as we upgrade the vehicle, but... It's fun. <laughs> to the pumping station! Used to be my club name, that. Are the challenges random? Because I can't seem to go back and pick them up. They seem to be at least partially random. Allons-y! Right? I want to trade, but you're in a slightly awkward place, I'm afraid. Ah, oh, crap. Ah! <laughs> you got them, zombies. 
Nope, not the plate. That was that. Okay, cool. Heal up. Pop this bad boy open, just in case. Oh, yeah. Nothing at all. Some batteries. Gotta make sure we keep uh, stocking up on those screws as well. Right, what is the problem at the pumping station? Didn't we leave a guy behind here so he could take care of everything in our absence? Oh, and the door's been locked. Hmm. Hmm. Sus. Okay. Well, they're all shut. Oh, no. Oh, God. It has gone badly, hasn't it? <laughs> Now, why do I suspect that the game wants me to go through here? Oh my god. Can I go this way? No, this can't be it. I can't see a goddamn thing. <laughs> it is impossible to see. This is with the flashlight on. <laughs> Crane, you've just caught, like, every disease known to man. Seriously. Okay. Must be another way in. Not all the pumps have been affected. But enough of them have. Bloody Laura. Does this look... This looks kind of purposeful to me. Like someone's actually actively sabotaged it, you know? Okay. Scout around the outside first of all, see if we find any uh, doors. I don't think so though. I'm pretty sure I'm right in that I have to... Uh... Oh, why is the orange moved? Interesting. They tend to give you like a wide orange area and then as you get closer to the right place they, they shrink it down a little bit. It's making me very suspicious about this room. Didn't I just try this, though? But it's orange. Hmm. I really thought I was onto something here. And it seems not. Unless I can open this. Maybe I can. Oh, I can. Sweet. Ah, oh, yeah. Here we go. Uh, here we go. <laughs> I got a racing trophy. Must be the next one along. So the only two orange ones. If it's not orange, I ain't trusting it. Oh god, lockpicking. <laughs> imagine trying to lockpick underwater. I cannot imagine how agonizingly difficult this is to do. I mean, not for me, obviously. I'm, a, I'm an old pro, but I'm here now there. Up, and get your health back, your breath back, buddy. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. It's funny. I didn't really think we'd um, be swimming so much more in this, you know, this DLC out there in the, the wilderness, in the fields, etc. It didn't feel like a Bandits. Banditos. I've seen him with his wife up in the mountains. Please. Oh, yeah, it's a crossbow. Fucking time. I ain't lying, motherfucker. She looked better, like cured me. What the hell? What's going on? He's here. Get him. Oh, that was terrifying. <laughs> What's all that about? Oh my god. What's going on? Don't hurt me. I, I give up. I give up. Back here? Hello? <laughs> he downstairs? Oh, hello. Turn off that flashlight. All right. Well, that machete, though. You got it. But I've seen this uniform before. You're what's left of Rise's gang, huh? We're. I don't know. Exactly. They didn't tell me. I just joined. Quit lying, asshole. What are you fuckers doing out here? I don't know. I don't know. You understand I'm a hair away from killing you, right? Okay. Okay. 
I'll talk. But all I know is, the boss had a plan. Poison the water supply, loot everybody. He brought some corpses, threw them in the water. Jesus, you sick bastards. Who's your boss? Where is he? I don't know. I, I told you, I just joined. I didn't want to do it. I swear. Yeah, just following orders. Let's find out what Jazir has to say about that. See if he's in the mood to hear excuses. Come on, Chief. Don't do it. They'll fucking lynch me. I'm not gonna die. Not like that. Wow. Took two bullets to the face. Stopped pretty well. Good job, buddy. He had a very quick uh, turnaround of feeling, didn't he? I kind of feel bad for him. Eh, I mean, he did something terrible. And I was just following the orders. It's not a good excuse to do anything, really. Did you see him at the pumping station? Send some people here ASAP. And don't let anyone drink this water. What happened? Some bandits threw corpses into the water. Clean out the bodies and the water should clear up again. You got that? Of course. Thank you. We'll take care of it as soon as possible. I forgot this used to be a safe house. Um. Hooray! Oh! We dingalinged! Upgraded crossbow. Very nice. Oh, wait. Maybe I shouldn't have upgraded my. Oh, interesting. I think they'll probably give me one for free, so we'll hold on again. Get to the Eye of the Sun. No. Uh, we're doing this next. Hey, what's this over there? Oh, yeah, I guess we'll do that afterwards. Alright, cool. Kyle, you've shown that you truly believe what you're doing is right. Soon you will become one of us. I feel like I've skipped a lot of the. Uh... <laughs> the quests related to the guys because I've done so much outside of it kind of thing. Oh! That's the special boy! Oh my god, hello. Okay! He's a big boy! Is that hit me, but whatever. Okay, so what did we learn from the last big boy? That explosives are my friend. So, let's do just that. Blueprints! Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Throwing weapons. Uh, yeah. As a side note, this is why whenever I'm at the shop, <clears throat> I buy literally everything available because <laughs> you never know what you're gonna need. I'll do for now. Can't catch a break for this dude, can I? This has gone very badly. <laughs> ah! Get up, kid! Get up, kid! Crane! On your feet, soldier! What? Alright, what's going on? Plenty time. <sighs> God, I've done no damage, but I suppose I'm not trying to do damage. I'm trying to break the uh, the armor. Hello. <laughs> What the hell just hit me? Why do I keep spending so long on the ground? Is it because of the shrap- like the effect of the explosion maybe? It's just absolutely wrecking me? I'm, I'm, I'm just living on the earth. Right, you are a problem child. Uh, can we make anything else that would be useful? 
Kurtz bombs. Make some of those. And... The problem is always, how do these bombs work? Are they a throw bomb? Are they a drop bomb? It's a throw bomb. Going in. Oh. Ow! <laughs> Stop it, Holla! Oh yeah, now you get friends. Oh, get stuffed. I was waiting for the entire thing for him to get friends. <laughs> Changes his mind at the last bloody second. I hate that. I hate that. I can side. I don't know what my like highest damage option is. I think it's just going at him with the shotgun. Alonzi. Is there any way to dodge that? <laughs> or any of this really? Made a bloody dent. <sighs> I don't want to leave though, because what if he gets his health back? Just trying to put a dent in the helmet. Yep, that was badly timed. <laughs> I just want to break the helmet. I think if I can do that, I've got it. But it's going to be another situation where I don't have any bloody ammo left by the end of it. Oh. There's got to be a better way to do this. There has to be, surely. I'm not doing anything right, I'm gonna go try and hit him. I'm just gonna bloody hit him. Come on, holler, you bitch. <laughs> Ow. Can't tell if that's effective or not. Is that doing any damage? Yeah, a little bit actually. Ah, it does a double hit. You can't hit me like that! That's so mean! Charge me, bitch. Thank you. I don't do any damage. <laughs> uh oh. 
Fuck off, game. <laughs> no, don't touch me now! Game, seriously! Get him, get him! Get him, get him! I'm not even halfway! Alright, no, this is stupid. There's gotta be a better way to do this. I will come back and find it some other time. I'm really hoping I haven't just thrown away all that ammo and all that weapon upgrade stuff, but I'm, I'm not convinced that I would have killed him using every piece of ammo I had. Alright, you guys need to die, though. <laughs> what are you doing to my vehicle? Yeah, I don't think I'd have killed him if I hit, if put every single bullet into him and uh, everything else. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'll get there someday. Hollow. There's got to be a better way to do it than I was doing it. Has to be. Have I told you how much I hate you? <laughs> Sit down, stop being a pain in the ass. Uh, I might not be able to be able to drive across here. Maybe not, actually. No, no I think I go that way. <sighs> I really want to kill him! I'm so annoyed! I think I'm missing something. Maybe there's like an environmental advantage. Maybe I just need more bombs? I'm hoping he doesn't regenerate his health, but if I had to guess, I suspect as soon as you like leave his health bar behind kind of thing, he gets his health back, you know? I'll come get you, pal. Don't you worry about it. Ow. I gotta say, these guys are way more annoying on a vehicle compared to not. It doesn't necessarily feel like that should be the case, but it very much is. Pal? So stilly stuff. I pray for the God of the Sun to bless you. Yeah. And here's something from me. Thank you. You're just a walking bag of XP as far as I'm concerned, pal, I've gotta tell you. Cannot wait till I get some proper defences on this thing. Just something to get rid of those guys. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, at least these ones are easy. I have no health though. Womp womp. 4,000 XP. It's quite a lot. This has felt like a... Uh... Slightly disastrous video, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I don't feel like anything's gone particularly well for me. Where have I spawned? I suppose I spawned at this one rather than that one. That's fine. Man, this could get super annoying if you spawned like super far away from your car. I guess why that's, that's probably why there's hunting towers. Because otherwise, sometimes you would spawn miles away from your vehicle and it would be a massive. Pain in the booty, that's the cool kids say, probably. Right, this time, you big boy. See, why, why couldn't the other dude do that? <laughs> hey. I didn't think we had a prayer until you turned up. You showed them. To be fair, I just got the XP back, I suppose. Not the end of the world. Okay, I need a better place to do this. Nearly? 
Nelly! Get out of the way, zombie! Nice! So, sorry, what's going on? I'm focused on my sick driving skills. <laughs> Ooh, bolter! Eh. Okay, it's in an awkward place. Ram, da, 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 da. God damn trees! It's always the trees. <laughs> I'm not coming for you, buddy. Oh. God damn trees. I want a flamethrower. Oh, you cheeky son of a bitch. Being a real pain in the ass, you know that. Why don't I just shoot him? Out of curiosity. That's fun, I suppose. This is quite enjoyable. <laughs> Annoying, but fun. Come here. I feel sorry for him. He must be so scared. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Come here. <laughs> Oh no 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 no! <sighs> Got no ammo for the one gun that would be useful in this situation. Why would you ever run them down? That's a thousand times easier. Just run up to them and shoot them. Why would I ever chase them? Oh, it's dumb. Uh, something like a... They mentioned a house nearby? Do I have anything on my map? Is it this? No, oh, Nelly. Oh, another baller. I don't really care. I don't know how many I need for the mission, actually. I should check. Oh, I only need one. Never mind. I mean, maybe this is like a repeatable turn-in, but I'm not going to commit to that if I don't know. Whee! <laughs> Honey, I'm home. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's going on. They're in the house. They're spooked. Because the zombies. Close the gate. What gate? Does it just mean inside the. It must mean inside the house. Ah, yeah. Heave! I'm inside something. <laughs> Just zombie bits, I suppose. God damn! <laughs> hmm. Hey. Thank you. Thank you, Seb. We didn't think we were going to make it. Oh, yeah, Rabbi. Yadonia. Uh, we really don't ha We don't really have anything we could give you in return for your help. But I can promise you'll always find shelter here. Appreciate that, thanks. Until some more zombies come and break into your house and ruin you guys. Bunch of nerds. Where do we get us? Wait, how do I get out? <laughs> I just blocked out the only exit. No. Must be upstairs, right? It's usually like a roof sort of shebang. Preserve your radio batteries, people! In a zombie apocalypse, it's not easy to find. Like, seriously, how do I get outside? 
<laughs> this was their plan all along, to trap me in their little hellhole of a house. Uh, it, no, there's an upstairs, right? I can see the, the board and there's lots of... Where is the... How blind am I? There's a staircase somewhere. Is it in here? Oh. oh. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> what am I missing? Oh, there it is. Bloody Nora. I thought I was going mad. Did a little bit. <laughs> uh, this is not a way out. Wait, no. This is not a way out. Oh god, it is. I thought the game had gone mad. And me. Stuck on a wire out on the fence. I kind of just want to level up my vehicle. We're very close. Uh, what's this? Oh, right. Well, I figured, because there's a fence right here, that'd be a good way to do it. Must be the best way to do these. I don't care, I've got things to do. Go away, zombie scum. I'm on a time limit here. Ugh. Nearly there. Ish. I think we might make this one. Yeah, it should be fine, right? Yeah! Nice! Screw you! <laughs> No, there's very few things better in life than a good handbrake turn, you know? It's a special... It's a special moment. Oh, we got over here. Oh, it's another military place. Come on, free repair. Uh oh. Oh no! <laughs> I swear that used to kill me. In like one hit. Maybe my tactic of just throwing my body in there is effective. Who knows? You're not military people. You're the, the bloody military spouses, aren't you? Unquestionably the worst people on the planet, by the way. <laughs> Sorry if you happen to be a military spouse. And then not all military spouses are terrible, terrible people, don't get me wrong. But a lot of them are, just because it's this weird entitlement. Cool. <laughs> oh, you cheeky little blighter, that was good. Where have you all started to come? Why is there like 25 billion of you all of a sudden? What the hell? It was fine here a second ago. I'm gonna die for fuck's sake. Ugh! Where? Why? Why? <laughs> I don't really understand why I just suddenly got mauled by a billion of them. I didn't even make any noise. I wasn't even using a gun for god's sake. Screw you lockpicking. Ugh. Ugh, I might just do that. I mean, I'm right next to it. Honestly, might just do this here and then the chips will fall where they may. We're nearly at the end of this, you know. Okay, driver level. Buggy parts. There's gonna be buggy parts in it. We need those to get all of these, so. And we can get the ramming bar next level. Very cool. Excited about that one. Mind me, I need to get some ammo. Okay, so next video, we are going to go to the gathering. Wait, is that up there? Am I climbing this? <laughs> God only knows. But we're going to go to the gathering, which is... Uh, I probably have to follow this road, don't I? Yeah, we'll go back and get the buggy. Then we'll go up to the gathering. We'll do that, and we'll do other things. Things are cool. I'm going <laughs> to... 
Think about how I'm going to kill... What's his name again? Hopper? I can't remember his name. The big boy. I'm going to think about how to kill the big boy as well. Until then, thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you lovely folks next time. Cheers, much love as always. Bye-bye.